to get to this wild chase that took place through three counties. Someone stealing a fire truck from Miami-Dade County, sending law enforcement on that hot pursuit before the suspect was finally arrested. Annalise Garcia live in North Miami Beach with this exclusive video from the whole situation as it went down. Annalise. JC, good morning. So this is the home base of that truck. We actually just saw it roll out, so we know it is back in service this morning. Now, it was stolen not too far from here. It went on an hour, nearly an hour long chase, Tri-County, and ended near Boynton Beach. Exclusive video of the moment a man is arrested on the turnpike after a chase across three counties, Miami, Dade, Broward and Palm Beach. Bro, it's a <laughs> stolen fire truck out of Miami. Traffic cameras captured as a fire truck. Yes, a fire truck led police on a chase. Only on Local 10, you're seeing this photo of the driver. His name is Algenard LeCambric. <laughs> Local 10 there as the fire truck heads back to 95 from Sunrise Boulevard. This cell phone video shot around 8 p.m. Thursday showing a police cruiser on its tail. Close to 9 p.m. is when the chase ended on the northbound lanes of the turnpike just after the Boynton Beach exit. Traffic cams captured the moment he gives up. We're trying to get home from West Palm. Traffic at a standstill at one point, people waiting to get through. I just want to know what the plan was in like the next step of that. So I guess we're going to wait this out, but it was the, probably the most interesting traffic jam I've ever been in. Lots of people stuck with no idea what had just happened with reactions like these. Why would somebody send a fire truck? <laughs> this is wild. Like, you, you know, like you think it's a car accident. It's like, oh no, I hope everybody's okay. And then I hear people walking by saying that it's a, <laughs> it's a high speed chase with a fire truck. Friday morning, our cameras rolling as truck 32 rolled out of the fire station back in service after the wild chase. Now, LeCambric is facing some serious charges. We are expected to see him in court this morning. I am live in North Miami Beach. Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News.